From meals and drinks for students to adult beverages, local restaurant and bar owners are looking forward to keeping to-go cocktails on the menu. The governor just signed that bill into law, but some groups are worried, saying alcohol is already a health and safety issue. Josh Sanchez joins us now with both sides of the debate. Josh? Chair Siobhan, for three years, takeout customers have gotten used to cocktails to go. It was a practice that some restaurants tamped into during the COVID-19 pandemic. It's been in place for so long that some people I spoke with today say they were surprised that a law was signed making it permanent. If I would have known that, I probably would have a cocktail in my hand right now. A pandemic era practice is here to stay in Michigan. To go cocktails were part of takeout menus for some restaurants during the height of the pandemic. I think it's really cool. Like, for, I'm we're from Germany, mm -hmm. and so like for us, it's like really normal. And cocktails to go have been a pretty normal thing for Tate Skiba at Meats Barbecue. His restaurant has been offering its signature cocktails to go for a while. Tonight, he's in high spirits because of the new law and says it's another way for restaurants to branch out. It's like they do a lot of takeout business, and that might be another aspect for them to look at and say, hey, you know what? We do a lot of takeout. Maybe we could sell some more alcohol to go and help drum up more sales. Ross Carpenio with the Creole Burger Bar in Lansing. He's been relying on the social district to stay afloat, which allows people to enjoy alcohol outside if they bought it from nearby restaurants. He says he's already working on their next seasonal cocktail menu for people to enjoy in those districts and at home. We get a lot of people who come in, they'll have their drinks for here, not even realizing they could take one to go. Some advocacy groups focused on safe alcohol use are finding the new law hard to swallow. They say along with health concerns, alcohol is already easily available. So all these things collectively, I think, is cause for concern because we've seen an increase in alcohol related to liver disease. Alcohol uh, involved fatal crashes has been up to the past 10 years. Several people say they are on board with the idea as long as everyone keeps it safe. I just turned 21, so it's always nice to be able to get a drink and not have to sit down for it, especially because sometimes you just don't want to leave your house, and that's convenient. Um, I mean, there could be some downsides to it potentially, um, but as long as people are careful about it and make sure everything's regulated, I think it should be great. Now, 22 other states and Washington, D.C. have moved to make cocktails to go permanent, and a handful of others are considering similar bills. Back to you.